Hey, what's going on, guys? So, literally, like, more like four seconds ago, I literally just got the notification Incredibles 2 official trailer. So, I'm like, okay, I, I guess I gotta react to this then. So, I was just about to record my review for Ready Player One. Yes, that should be coming maybe later today now because Incredibles 2, you know, that's a priority. But we have an official trailer here. So far, I'm not sure what to make of it. You know, Pixar really do have like a history of releasing trailers that never live up to the actual film itself. Like, remember the, the Toy Story 3 trailer? I mean, that was kind of meh. And Toy Story 3 was amazing. The trailer for Finding Dory wasn't really that great either, but the film came out pretty good. I mean, I thought Finding Dory was good. Most people thought it wasn't as good. Finding Dory wasn't as good as Finding Nemo. Let me get that straight. But how long have we been waiting? We've been waiting 16, 15 years for this now. Why they do? There are three Cars films, and we're only just now getting Incredibles 2. What is that Pixar? We're gonna go ahead and react to this. So uh, yeah, let's just go check this out. All right. Did you wash your hands? With. I mean, already the animation is so much better than it was before. Did you dry them? <laughs> is this all vegetables? Who ordered all vegetables? I did. So, also the new voice actor for Dash. To talk about it? Almost right. accurate. The elephant it was really good. in the room. What elephant? Mm, this looks good. Mom's new job. Okay. It's time to make some wrong things right. Hey, the OG suit. Help me bring supers back into the sunlight. We need to change people's perceptions about superheroes, and Elastigirl is our best play. Better than me? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I like mom's new job. Bye, sweetie. I'll watch the kids, no problem. All right. Okay. That's not the way you're supposed to do it, Dad. They want us to do it. <laughs> I don't way. know that way. Why would they change math? Right. Math, okay, math is math. Those who are parents hey, know honey, what this is about, man. Everything's great. Is she having adolescence? And Jack Jack? Well, I think uh, Violet's on her He's period. I don't know. <laughs> what the? Num num cooking. Oh, my God. Cooking. <laughs> Whoa. Okay. That is freaky. You know it's crazy, right? To help my family, I gotta leave it. To fix the law, I gotta break it. You've got to. So our kids Woo! have that choice. Thank you, young nice. man. <laughs> okay. That theme. That theme. What does that mean? It means fire, Robert. Nice. Nice. Green Slater interrupts this program for an important announcement. Suit up. It might get weird. I'll be there ASAP. Where you going ASAP? You better be back ASAP. <laughs> yes. Oh, fuck. Yeah, <laughs> Frozen's what? <Bro> <laughs> Alright, so that was my reaction to the Incredibles 2 official trailer. Much better than the previous trailers we've been seeing because, you know, the previous trailers have basically been showing that um the majority of the film would just be a, at i guess home while elastigirl does her thing but no it, it, it looks a lot more than just that still doesn't look as good as the first one i don't think that's ever gonna happen because um if you didn't know already incredibles is in fact my number one favorite pixar film finding nemo as my second favorite and the original toy story as my third do you know what sucks the fact that the UK is going to get this a month later than everyone else because this comes out in June for the US. For the UK it comes out in July. We get to, we have to wait a whole month. This is exactly what happens with Finding Dory as well. Finding Dory came out in June, beginning of June, somewhere in the beginning of June for the US. We get a whole month later, beginning of July. And, and everyone else has been done watching that and by that time Finding Dory is irrelevant. That's when we're getting it. So we're, we're, the UK just get it late. I don't know why. I don't even know. The audience is just gonna be filled with like, adults. It's gonna be, there's gonna be more adults than there are kids for this film. I, I'm gonna say that right now because we've been waiting for this. Right, it's taken long. But it won't look good when a grown man is gonna be asking to go see Incredibles 2 by himself. But at the same time, I don't think I don't think anyone would care. 
Today's generation, they don't even understand, man. They don't understand Incredibles, do we? Like, whoa, 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 who, who are the Incredibles? Like, bruh, the Incredibles happened before all we have all these superhero movies now. Like, Incredibles came way before that. Incredibles is the best Fantastic Four film, and you know it's right. This is looking a lot better than before. Um, I'm pretty sure that Brad Bird is gonna uh, give us a lot of surprises in the uh, in the final film. Um, I'm glad that uh, Frozone's wife is back. I want there to be another where's my super suit moment. You already know that there has to be another moment like that. That's like the most iconic part of the first Incredibles fam. That was so funny. And that's all I really got to say. I'm very excited for this. Um, just sucks that we get it later. That's all we got. Uh, yeah, so if you enjoyed this reaction, make sure to like, comment and subscribe. Have a good day and peace. Thank <laughs> you.